Hello everybody. Today I'm going to show you a quick video of how easy it is to create a sales quote in Microsoft Dynamics NAV 2016. As you can see right now, I have NAV 2016 loaded and I'm currently on the home page. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go over here, I'm gonna click sales quotes and then click new. And the sales quote form pops right up. Next, you wanna add your sell to customer. We're gonna go with new concepts furniture. Once you click it, all the fields automatically populate. Real nice, real smooth, no problems. Next, you wanna add your items. So we'll click item. And then we wanna pick, uh, let's do a touring bicycle. Now we wanna add our quantity. So quantity, uh, I guess we'll do two. Want to check our unit of measurement code. I'm just good at pieces. You can see 4,000. It's already populated with our, with our code, our discount, and everything. Total included, 7,200. Uh, it's nice because you can actually see this right here, right in front of you as you're adding items to your sales quote. And over here to the left, you have the invoice discount amount. So if we add an amount, let's add $250. And what will happen is once we enter it and hit enter, the invoice discount percentage will automatically populate 3.47%. And then right below in the invoicing section, you can see that the bill to customer number and the name of the customer and the city or, and everything, all our stuff has all been, has been completely populated and added real nice and then we can come up here and we can add comments if we want so what we'll do is we'll add the comment uh this price is good through let's say february 15th of 2017 it's real nice because this is a reminder for us in the future that you know we we, we give certain customers uh, different provisions and then over here on the banner, you you know you can print your invo uh, print your sales quote from here, or email the sales quote from here. And then when you're done, you just want to hit the little X right here, and it'll take you back to where all your other sales quotes are listed. We only have one because we've only done one so far. And then you click the number, and it pops up right away. And from here, this is actually where you go to delete your sales quote if you want. Uh, let's make sure everything's good. All right, let's try deleting it. Yep, click yes. And there it is, completely deleted. Thanks a lot, hope this helps. Have a great one.